Hello, my name is Phil Baldino of the Woodwind Teaching Studio, and in today's segment we're going to discuss the assembly of the B-flat clarinet. In assembling the B-flat clarinet, there are actually a couple different ways, but the way I feel is the most beneficial, especially for young beginning clarinetists, is first identifying the parts, also making sure you have a little bit of cork grease, to apply to the tenon joints of each section so that we don't get so much friction that we cannot easily adjust the joint. You want to remember in assembling both the lower joint, the larger, and the upper, we want to refrain from taking the hands and grasping it just wildly over the keys trying to eliminate the bending of springs and rods. So, first of all, make sure that the tenon joints here have a little lubrication with some cork grease. Now, this type is applied by hand. There are the types of cork grease that you can get in the tube, similar to chapstick. And all you need is a little, little dosing on each joint. The lower joint is the larger. The upper joint is the smaller of the two largest pieces of the clarinet. In assembling, the lower joint, pardon me, the upper joint, with the left hand, should be put in the palm where the fingers are going to depress the keys so that this bridge key is up. The right hand taking care of the lower part of the instrument where the thumb closes off the lower pads pushes and twists at the same time to where the two bridge keys line up accordingly. When I have accomplished that, I then take the bell and handling with my left hand the lower joint and then again in a pushing twisting motion, join the bell to the lower joint. The next part, the barrel, again, taking the left hand, depressing the keys, not randomly over the keys, again, to avoid bending rods or springs, and push and twist. And I should say also, I always try to align the logo of the barrel and of the upper joint basically for aesthetic purposes. And last, but of course not least, this is the assembled mouthpiece. We will talk later about the assembly of the mouthpiece. But as it is assembled, applying it with, again, just a vertical pressure straight down so that this behind register key aligns with the reed on the back side of the mouthpiece. And there we have the assembled clarinet.